Hello, let's talk about thalassemia today. Thalassemia is a genetic disorder that affects millions of people worldwide. But today our focus is on thalassemia trait and what are the clues on cell counter and peripheral blood smear that can lead to diagnosis of thalassemia trait. Identification of thalassemia trait involves paying attention to RBC count and mean corpuscular volume and hemoglobin. When we have borderline low hemoglobin along with comparatively high RBC count and disproportionately low mean corpuscular volume, that is a red flag. We can also calculate what is called Menzer index in which we divide MCV by RBC. If the division is less than 13, it is highly suspicious for thalassemia trait. Our RBC histogram is also shifted to left compared to what you see on the right. And what you see on this peripheral smear are the RBC with microcytosis and lots of targetsis. These are the clues to the diagnosis of thalassemia trait. Confirmation is done by an investigation called HPLC in which we find that the HbA2 levels are above 3.5%, sometimes up to 8-9%. to Importance of thalassemia trait is that uh, if a woman is found to have a thalassemia trait, her husband should also be screened for thalassemia trait and if both are having thalassemia trait, then their potential baby can be offered a prenatal diagnosis of thalassemia which will help us prevent thalassemia major in the population. Thank you.